They love their football. They have been driving towards a county junior championship really and truly since 1944. And now they are standing on the brink of history. Well, I can only imagine just how quiet right now the villages of Kong, Cross, the Neil, and indeed all around Ardenry are as well this is on this uh, Saturday evening. Because most of the villages, I'm sure, are here in Castle Bar, and those that aren't, I can only assume or presume are tuned into Midwest Radio because nobody will want to miss a moment of this county junior final. Well, the tackling, as you'd expect, is fierce and it is uh, relentless. Sean Cosgrove and Sean has put it away. Sean has put it over the bar. They didn't score from play the last day. It took them about 40 seconds today. John Varley has put the ball straight between the posts. Peter Cosgrove is having a stormer. He's winning ball all the time in there. Wasn't counting on three waiting for him round the corner. That was an ambush, old-fashioned style. The captain of the team, the heartbeat in a lot of ways of the need. And he lurges his men on from the sideline and Robert Holin is coming in and they'll hear the roar on the Galway border for John Gunnoff and Robert coming on. Martin got his block in there, has played fantastically well at cornerback. Wedge gets in and he's gone for the goal and Henley has done it again. That's the second time in this county final that Keith Henley has come to the Neil's rescue. Simon Ryan from Kong leaves us with a one-point game again. Paddy Hopkins, who started the drawn match, who's in for the last 13 and a half minutes, and he's a very experienced player, Paddy Hopkins. And no surprise that six foot five, maybe six foot six inch, John Varley has gone straight into full forward. The Neil need a goal to send this county final to extra time. They have an extra man, but they need a goal. Towards Pat Casey, he risked life and limb to get that ball, and he has it. In comes Pat Lacken. Lacken has given away the free, the Neil of a free in on the 20 meter line. What do they do? 40 seconds get of a goal, injury Mike. time left. Try and get a goal. It's 20 he meters out. Go for a pint anyway. He's gone for the goal! Oh, he's got it! Oh, that's incredible! Absolutely incredible! Sean Cosgrove from the 20 meter line has drilled it to the roof of the net. How or oh, how did that go in? It is a question that will never be answered. Four minutes of injury time played and Sean Cosgrove has just kicked the goal that sends us to extra time. Well, that is enough to take your breath away. We thought we'd seen it all down through the years here in Castlebar. <laughs> Paddy Hopkins selling dummies like they're going out of fashion. And he finishes it off with a spectacular point off his left foot. And now Paddy Hopkins gets on the ball again, waits for the run, the run of Cosgrove. Oh, that's unbelievable. Sean Cosgrove kicks it high and over the bar and make no mistake, the Neil are kicking for home here. Drops dangerously, in goes Niall Welch, pulls it first time and it's gone up and it's gone over the bar. Owen Hughes who puts the pedal to the metal, Owen Hughes driving through and Owen Hughes off the kick -over. Fires it over the bar. That was defiant with a capital D. Aidan O'Sullivan has it. O'Sullivan kicks it high. And Aidan O'Sullivan kicks it over the bar. There are plenty of Neil men back there. And one of them is Owen Hughes. And if you ever wanted a man to be standing between the ball and your goal line, it would be Owen Hughes. 
They shoot for the score from out the country and it's gone over the bar. That's surely the end of that. At this moment, nothing matters to the Neil except that final scoreline. 117 to two goals and nine. And for the first time in the history of the club, we find ourselves saying the Neil are county junior football champions. And very, very shortly, a very proud man, their captain, John Varley, will climb the steps. That's if that left knee will stand up to it to receive the McDonald Cup. They have waited a long, long time for a day like this. This particular group of players will go down in history as the first group of players to bring a county junior championship title back to the South Mayo Club. And it will be some bank holiday weekend in Kong, Cross and the Neil. And the last, I'd like to thank the lads. Lads, you're going to go a long way in life. You're going to do a lot of things and travel to a lot of places. But you will never, ever forget this day, so you will not. Never.